just a few miles, but it looks like just, again, this is going to be just north of Newcastle, but then this, looking at the velocity, look at the picture right there, this is tightening up, this rotation here, you can see this, this tornado, this is the early stages of this tornado right here, you can see it right here, moving to the east, as we paint across here, you can see this is coming in from Chris Lee and Bastion at 5, tornado, you can clearly see it, it, it is on the ground there, that is, that is definitely there on the ground, so we've got this tornado, perfectly. Is it recording? Yes. All right, so today, round three of the severe weather extravaganza of May 2013. There is a, currently a tornado on the ground heading towards Moore. We are leaving Norman now. We're gonna try to get a few shots of this tornado before it's out of range, because I don't feel like pulling it yesterday. Awesome shot. That's where he's gonna go. Okay, David, uh, uh, it's on uh, 149, just crossed in. Uh, move it forward, move it forward. It's always on that side. I really should probably be sitting in the back. <laughs> probably. Move in the back. You probably have time right now if you got out. Where is it? That's right by Walmart. That Walmart right there? Yeah. Is this thing, it's gonna hit it or it's over it right now? It looks like it's heading towards it. It's like right on the... So where is it going to be? Is it directly out of us, or...? Oh, it's still that way. It's still that way, okay. So we're going to be able to get a view of it uh, okay. kind of passing north of us, if it holds together. Yeah. But we're still far enough okay. east where we should be able to get up to it. Right, oh, it's right over there. You can see it. Fuck me. Yeah, I wouldn't. Let's go park. 
All right, you can see it on the ground. Dude. Dude, get out of the car. Tornado, right there. pictures of it. Cops actually blocked off the road south of us. Uh. Luckily, we were just far enough along. Gotta love, it. you know you're in Oklahoma. Everybody's outside looking at it. I know, it's crazy. All right, so the, the tornado actually passed over this road. Can you see it? You, you can yeah. actually see the funnel. Yeah. Holy shit. I, I'm not, I can't quite tell. It's, it's over there. Oh yeah, there we go. Let's see. Is that another? Is that? I can't tell. <laughs> All right, now no, no, start filming the road. <laughs> There's shit over there in the road. Yeah. Like, it almost looks like a vehicle. Look at that piece of twisted metal. Look at this, it passed over this, look at the rail, yeah, well. the guardrail. I think that might, that's maybe developing into another tornado right there. Look, all right, now this is where it went over. All these trees are knocked down by it. Oh, shit. Yes, look at that. Yeah. A huge cloud right there. Yeah. That's the development. Oh, shit. We are heading directly in tomorrow. We are actually on 19th Street, heading west. We are east of the highway, but we'll be there very soon. And apparently we've got smoke coming up here. Uh, cops have been a huge pain in the ass pretty much the entire way. And all they've been doing is blocking traffic everywhere we go. Are you gonna go? Apparently, people don't know what's going on. Cops just went off and blocked northbound traffic. So I'm going straight. I have no idea what is going on here. I don't know why you can't go north, but there's a huge bill of smoke up here. We are going to investigate and see. And there's no power at all either. It's gonna drive over this wooden slob. Well, 
least the wire tower's okay. Yeah. They were saying that the debris cloud was heading in this area uh, before. When we were, as we were leaving, it was heading towards this area. So, as long as it didn't take down the Warren Movie Theater. That looks like it's coming from Walmart. So do you recognize where we are? Yeah, I think so. This is the highway. This is where we would get off to go to the movie theater. Okay. We would get off over here. I just want to see what's going on. I'm sure that's what everybody else is doing. <laughs> We see you. We hear you. This traffic sucks when the lights are out. I know. There's nowhere to go. There it is right there. It's not the Walmart. And there's not and the Warren is still intact. Yeah. So that's good news. But whatever it is is right over there. You can see it billowing. Yeah. I'm getting on the fucking highway. I don't know, just try to keep filming that. I can't tell what it is. Highway. There we go, now it's recording. Look at the highway. How coated with shit it is from the tornado. We're the only people on the highway. I don't know if we're supposed to be. No, it wasn't blocked off, so... They're too busy trying to rescue people who are in that burning rubble. Yeah. As you can see from the rest of this video, uh, we were on that storm and we witnessed some of the destruction that the tornado caused. However, at the time we had no idea the extent and how many people were really affected, affected directly by the tornado. We knew, we had some idea that a lot of stuff had happened and there may have been some people who were injured. Um, I really can't describe how, how sick this entire tragedy has made me and how sobering of a reality it's been to experience it firsthand. Uh, in this video, I just tried to show my perspective of the situation, and uh, I had no idea at all the, the scope of damage and the scope of lives that were affected by it. I, it's something you can't comprehend when you're in the middle of something like that until you reflect and look back at the situation. So if you were affected directly, or you had loved ones that were in the path of that tornado, my heart goes out to you. And I wish there was something I could do to help ease your pain, and something I could do to help you out. So, I'd like to thank you for watching this video, and I wish you the best of luck in the future. Uh, take it easy.